variable separable differential equation hello everyone in this lecture we are going to learn how to solve variable separable differential equation variable separable differential equation is one of the very important first order differential equation uh, to solve many problems in the quantum mechanics uh, classical mechanics uh, and electromagnetic theory and also in others papers also you need to learn how to solve a variable separable differential equation and other than this there are direct questions in the CSER net and also in the gate examinations uh, and also in the many set examinations you can find uh, to, so, uh, to solve variable separable differential equation so in this class uh, we are going to learn uh, what is variable separable differential equation and how to solve it so a variable separable uh, differential equation is a first order differential equation in which we can separate the variables so first we have to know what is variables in a differential equation consider a first order differential equation dy by dx plus 2x into y equals to k into x square in every differential equation there will be at least two variables in which one will be dependent variable and another will be independent variable so in this differential equation y is dependent variable and x is independent variable it means that the value of y depend on x but x is not depending on y y is depending on x so in this example y is a dependent variable dependent variable and x is independent variable independent variable And the solution of a differential equation is the value of dependent variable as a function of independent variable. So the solution of this differential equation will be y of x. Okay. So finding the solution of a differential equation means we are finding the value of a dependent variable as a function of a independent variable. Another example another example d square theta upon dt square plus g by h into theta equals to zero this is a second order differential equation here also there is two variables one is theta another is time t so here theta is a dependent variable theta dependent variable dependent variable and time t is independent variable independent variable some differential equation contains more than one independent variable such differential equations are known as a partial differential equation so sometimes you have in some differential equation uh, dou v by dou x and dou y something like this so here look plus 2x uh, into y equal to 0 consider this differential equation so here you can see that uh, x v is a dependent variable because v is a function of x and y and y and x is independent variable here this type of differential equation is known as a partial differential equation and if there is only one independent variable such a differential equation generally known as a ordinary differential equation so what is variable separable differential equation variable separable differential equation is a 
first order ordinary differential equation in which we can separate the variables we can separate variables means we can take the dependent variable on the one side of the equation and independent variable on the other side of equation if we can do it then such differential equations are known as variable separable differential equation okay so i will give uh, one example dy by dx plus 2xy equal to 0 this is a first order variable separable differential equation here y is independent y is a dependent variable x is independent variable now we can write dy by dx is equal to minus 2xy now separate the variables dy by y equals to minus 2x into dx so look in this differential equation uh, we have taken dependent independent dependent variable on the left hand side of the equation and independent variables on the right hand right hand side of the equation so if we can separate the dependent and independent variables such differential equations are known as variable separable differential equation if we cannot separate the variables then it is not a variable separable differential equation it may be other type of first order differential equation there are many different types of first order differential equation like first order linear differential equation exact differential equation and bernoulli's differential equation homogeneous differential equation there are many other types in which variables cannot be separated okay so the main one of the main important type is the uh, first order variable separable differential equation now we will learn how to solve this how to solve step one since uh, step one is a uh, separate variables separate variables since it is a variable separable differential equation the first step is to solve is separate the variables means it take independent variable on one side of the equation and dependent variable on the other side of the equation there may be constants constant you can write any side step two integrate on both side integrate on both sides and add a constant of integration because this is will be indefinite integrals so you have to add a constant of integration and add a constant of constant of integration so in the step 2 you will get the solution solution means you will get the value of a dependent variable as a function of independent variable if it is a dy by dx equation you will get a value of y as a function of x now in the most of question there will be some initial values will be given like at x equal to 0 y equal to 1 at t equal to 0 x equal to 2 some initial values will be given in the problem so by using that initial values you have to find the value of constant of integration so that is a additional step step 3 so find the value of c find the value of c using initial conditions or boundary conditions initial conditions given okay so this these are the steps to solve the variable separable differential equation now we will solve one ccr net question and one gate question okay so first we are going to solve a ccr net question this is a ccr net june 2013 so please write down the question the solution of the differential equation 
the solution of the differential equation the solution of the differential equation dx by dt equals to x square with with the initial condition with the initial condition x of 0 equal to 1 will blow up will blow up as t tends to option a 1 option b 2 option c 1 by 2 option d infinity this is the question so what is the question it means here a differential equation is given you can see that it is a uh, variable separable differential equation because uh, you can take x on the one side of the equation and t on the other side of the equation so this is a variable separable differential equation the question is uh, the solution will blows up as t tends to solution means uh, the value of x as a function of t here x is a dependent variable and t is independent variable so the x of t that is the solution so at some point of at some value of t the x tends to infinity so we have to find that value blows up means the x tends to infinity so we have to find that value of t here so first let us solve the differential equation so the differential equation is dx upon dt equal to x square so what is step one separate the variables so take x on the left hand side so dx by x square and t time t terms on the right hand side so only we have one term that is dt we have separated the variables now step step two integrate on both sides so integral 1 by x square dx equals to integral dt and add a constant of integration c so this this is equals to uh, integral of 1 by x square is equal to minus 1 by x equal to integral of dt will be equal to t plus constant of integration so then we will get 1 by x will be equal to minus t plus c or x will be equal to minus 1 upon t plus c so this is the solution this is the x as a function of t now we have to find the value of c as i told you some initial condition will be given in the question so look at this question in this question x of 0 equal to 1 is given x of 0 equal to 1 it is equal what it means say at t equal to 0 the value of x is equal to 1 so what is given at t equal to 0 at t equal to 0 x is equal to 1 now we substitute let this is equation number 1 we substitute this in the equation number 1 and we will find the value of c so substitute x equal to 1 and t equal to 0 so 1 equal to minus 1 upon 0 plus c it means uh, c equal to minus 1 so the value of c equal to minus 1 now substitute the value of c in our solution so we will get x equal to minus 1 upon t t minus 1 t minus 1 so this is the solution of the differential equation and the question is uh, with the initial condition the solution will blow up as t tends to so for which value of t the solution x tends to infinity so you can see that uh, when the denominator equal to 0 it become the x tends to infinity x become infinity means it will then t will be equal to 1 so when t equal to 1 
x tends to infinity. So the correct option is option A. Option A is correct. This is a 3.5 mark in the 3.5 mark question in the CSR. Okay, now let us solve one gate question. The gate question is from gate 2016. Please write down the question. Consider the differential equation. Consider the differential equation. Consider the differential equation dy by dx equal to x into y if y equal to 2 at x equal to 0 then the value of then the value of y at x equal to 2 is given by at x equal to 2 is given by option a e raised to minus 2 option b 2 e raised to minus 2 option c e square option d 2 e square so in this question a differential equation is given that is a first order variable separable differential equation and one initial value is given that is a the value of y equal to 2 at x equal to 0. What do we have to find? We have to find the value of y at x equal to 2. Okay, so solve this differential equation. So the given differential equation is dy by dx equal to x into y. Now separate the variables. So we can write dy by y equal to x into dx step 2 integrate on both sides so integral dy by y equal to integral x dx plus constant of integration so integral 1 by y dy equal to log y equal to integral x dx is equal to x square by 2 plus constant of integration now we have to find the value of c using initial conditions what is given at x equal to 0 y is 2 this is given in the question so now substitute let this is equation number one now substitute the uh, x equal to 0 and y equal to 2 in the equation number one so we will get log 2 equal to 0 plus c it means c equal to log 2 the value of c equal to log 2. So now uh, write log y equal to now substitute the uh, value of c in the equation number 1. So we will get log y equal to x square by 2 plus log 2. We have to find the value of y. So log y minus log 2 equal to x square by 2 log of a minus log b log a minus log b equal to log of a by b so we can write log y by 2 equals to x square by 2 now take exponential on both side if you take exponential on the right hand side the log and exponential get cancelled so we will get y by 2 and in the right hand side we will get e raised to x square by 2 so the value of y equal to 2 into e raised to x square by 2. So this is the solution of this differential equation. But what is asked in this question? The value of y at x equal to 2. So now substitute x equal to 2. So y at x equal to 2 is 2 into e raised to 2 square by 2. So this is equal to 2 into e raised to 4 by 2 that is equal to 2 e square. So the answer is 2 e square. So which option is correct?
टू ई स्क्वायर ऑप्शन डी इज करेक्ट ऑप्शन डी इज करेक्ट टू ई स्क्वायर ओके सो दिज आर द वेरिएबल सपरेबल डिफरेंशियल इक्वेशन एंड हाउ टू सोल्व इट